Hello. So we are looking at Fire Emblem for the iPad. I guess also the iPhone and Android as well. This is the first look. This is the first time I'm ever starting the game. So we're gonna find out together what it's like to play. I booted it up. Booted it. I booted it up. Uh, it asked me to link my Nintendo ID. I did that, and it downloaded a large update. I did that. And that update just finished, and now we're going into the game. Uh, this game has made Nintendo about two million dollars in one day already. Nintendo's uh, iOS games are killing it. People are just eating them up, which is great because their games are awesome, and it's super cool that they're giving a little bit of their magic to the mobile platform and bringing a higher quality product to literally millions of uh, phone and tablet owners. So that's awesome. I have never played a Fire Emblem game. I have no clue what, how it even plays or what it's about. Uh, what's going on in this crazy ass intro? I'm gonna try to skip it. And we're gonna skip it. I'll have to pick a nickname now, right here on camera. Ah, oh, fuck. Look at my hall of women, let me think. You know I'm playing a female, I'm always a female. Why any man wants to run around looking at and controlling a man? I don't know, I don't. No thanks. I'll pass. Uh, let's name my character Billy. As in Billy Lord. God, I hope I spelled Billy right. It doesn't look right. Do I spell Billy? Who cares? <laughs> How do I care? I'm Billy now. Oh, there's some story. Oh, you're, oh, it's a woman. Oh, you're here. Then the ritual actually worked. <laughs> Am I doing this right? Oh, great hero from another world. Thou hast come so far to fulfill your role in our legend. Brink of ruin, etc., etc. Hero has come. Doubt thou art, yada, yada, yada. Uh-huh. Blah, blah, blah. How? Emblians, stand back. Hey. Oh, fuck. I mean, really? What did I miss in the last, like, two paragraphs I skipped? All of a sudden, I'm in the game. Is that little redhead me? Because she's awesome. I'm happy I named her Billy and not, like, Arnold. Just, what, if, what if it was a woman? A man, I mean. Axe is bigger than her. I love it. Love it. Good, but as commander, I must keep striving for more. All right, so she's got some stats here. Cleared that stage. Don't know what that stage was. It just dropped me in there. I guess I should have paid attention to the story. It's a whole bunch of story here. I'm just, you can see my finger tapping the screen. See it? That's my finger. I really don't care um, what this is all about. Maybe I should. Maybe this is a story-oriented game. I don't really know. Or if this is just a bunch of crap to start the game and then we play. But if that's going to be happening all the time, I guess I should uh, maybe read it. Here, look. There's Biggie. And there's Bunny. That's Ricky. Or Ricochet. That's Ziggle. Or Ziggy. Or Biggie. Or Dumbass. Or whatever we decide to call him. Oh, I was summoned here with the Breeder Blink. That's the name of this relic. Oh, she's got the Breeder Blink. The Breeder Blink doesn't look like any bow I've ever seen. It's the true key. And she used it to summon me. I am the comer of the Breeder Blink. There she is. Get her. Okay. Get who? Who was that? I don't like this. I'd rather it animate itself and just have like the text pop up. Alright, so some guys have shown up to fight. Alright, we're doing it. Player face. Alright, I gotta fight these guys. When Using you your bow. bow. You must keep space between you and your foe. Voice acting. 
Amazing. Maybe I want to turn up the sound a bit so you can hear it. Is that better? Can you hear it? I don't know. I'm listening through my receiver, so I can't really tell how you hear it. I'm cheating. All right, so I can move. So I noticed at the bottom of the screen, there's this little thing that shows what beats what, like sword beats axe beats arrow, I guess is what that is. So she has a bow and arrow symbol that doesn't match the bow and arrow symbol on the weapon triangle. Whatever. Apparently her special move is charged, but I, I don't know how to use it. Auto battle. What the fuck is the point of auto battle? Stupid. Let's go. I am so lost. I have no idea what I'm doing. This looks really good on my big TV, by the way. If you want to see how I'm playing, I'm syncing to my TV. And then that's where I'm doing all my recording from and controlling the camera and mic and whatnot. My iPad is right here in front of me. And my ugly face is right here. Did I win? I don't know. Quite so. It's a nice looking game, very sharp. iPad has a great screen. Very capable little, uh, very capable little gaming unit the uh, iPad is. Stage clear. Awesome. I don't, I just dragged my dudes around and that's, that's what I did. We won and it's all thanks to you, Billy, you super sexy thing you. Why none of us in the Order of Heroes can actually summon these heroes? Ha! I never doubted for a second that you... Oh, it's a woman. That you are the great hero. You are the one who will save our kingdom. Oh. Oh. I want you now. Oh, sorry. Our order is small. But please, welcome to our ranks. Help us. Etc. Who cares? God. I got a bunch of orbs. Oh, lovely. Not gems or jewels okay. or coins, but orbs. And now... There's new game download data available. Again, this is the second time. But in the middle of playing, 317 meg download. Are they nuts? It already downloaded like 90 meg when I first booted this up. I cut it out of the video because it was, you know, obviously boring. And now it's uh, doing another 319 meg. It's a little odd. And it might, might take a while. I have really fast Wi-Fi in this house. I have a wireless AC, um, which is super awesome because the Nintendo Switch is going to support that, but I think the iPad only supports up to N. 19%, 20%. Steam in the corner teasing me with all my friends playing all their awesome Steam games. I should be playing something on Steam. Oh, it's flying all of a sudden. Let us go. Music is skipping. I'm trying to listen to this guy sing. He's all like, ah, ah, ah. just like that. That's an exact representation of uh, what he was just doing. Uh, Swallow so loads. I'll tell you, I had a tooth out today. Well, yesterday, actually, I had a tooth out. It was real nasty. Cavity was all into the bones. Want to see it? I, uh, ah, that's it. They're all gone. I got nothing there. And I have to lose another one. This one. Soon, because it's badly infected, apparently, and very dangerous to me. So that's never good. I think we're going to skip ahead. Because I'm not sure you want to see me blab for another 50% of loading. I mean... Loading. <sighs> Creativerse. A few of my friends are in Creativerse. And I want to join them. But no. We're checking this game out. And... Sitting through a whole bunch of loading. 
There's no way I'm not cutting this out. This is stupid. Are you serious with this? It already loaded like 90 meg and then let me play for like five minutes and loads another 300 whatever meg it said. Stupid. What are you thinking? Do it all at once. Or do it in the initial download. I don't know. What is this? Is this all like new data? Is this it's only been out for a few days. It's interesting that it does it right through the app rather than through like an app store update like most apps. I'm seeing more and more of this these days. They're pushing uh, updates straight to the app. All right, so there you go. Here we are. Finally, uh, first time we're seeing a home screen. I guess that's my little team up there. Let's play the prologue. Yep. I thought that's what we just did. I hope I didn't just restart something we already did. There's a bunch of talking. We're gonna skip that. It drops us into a fight. Keep the weapon triangle in mind. All right. Red weapons are strong against green, and so on. Around the triangle. Why not just finish telling me? Red are stronger than green, or stronger than blue, or stronger than red. Right. Again, it's a different symbol for arrow um, on the characters and the weapons triangle. They should fix that. So he's red up here, up top, and the bottom is green. So the blue will beat the red. The red will beat the blue. So we want this guy to head towards the red. And we want this guy. No. Is that it? At the end of his turn? Oh yeah, she's done, so end turn. So we want the red guy with the sword to make his way down below. And he came after me, because he's a jerk off. There's blue, so green beach blue, so I can send yes, this douche up there. Oh here, I can move more than one character at a time. Damn it, I just have to tap him twice. Let's just find out how good Arrow is. So the fight seems to happen by itself. You just send them there and off they go. Still alive. Uh, red will be green, so we're gonna. We should be okay. Continuing to attack him. And the sound has disappeared. We have lost the sound. Let's tell me we've lost my internet connection altogether. I don't understand what just happened. Level up. Ooh, I've leveled up. <laughs> nice. Enemy phase. We'll uh, figure out this whole sound situation in a minute because right now there is no sound. Beat him. And we're done. Right? We're done? Oh, no, we didn't beat him. Duh. He's blue. We're going to go after him with green. I don't have green. I have this arrow dude. He has seven hit points. I have 14, so that was the end of him. That was easy. All right. She's all leveling up a bunch. That's super cool. Stage clear. Maybe I'll win some orbs or something. Oh, there's a big bad guy showing up. Who are you?
I guess there's a story going on that I should probably pay attention to. I'm so used to playing like little developers games that like make their games in their mom's basement and like, you know, I really don't care about the story. But I'm guessing this was put together by a tad more talented people. But now it's uh, coming from Intelligent Systems and Nintendo. This story might actually be good and worth reading, but we're going to skip it anyway. <laughs> got my orb. Got that quest. A bunch of other things popping up. And we're going to go ahead and figure out what the deal is with the sound. Ah, oh, jeez. I touched my volume. It came right back. So let's see. There's a shop here. I have 16 orbs. Of course, it wants us to buy them. Uh, 48 out of 50 stamina. If you look at the top left. There's a ticker. I guess that's gonna. I'm gonna regain a certain amount of stamina after a certain point. That timer ticks away. I'm going close to my table here. That's better. Let's see. 11 seconds. I'm not gonna wait. Let's upgrade castle. Boost experience points. Experience earned by 20% for one orb. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, I can do it again by using two orbs, and that's 40%. That's a, jeez, okay. Expand barracks for one. Expand barracks for one. Expand barracks again. Let's do the whole orb thing. Let's do, um, upgrade the castle. I'm running out of orbs now. That was expensive. That one was five. But uh, 60% now. And the barracks is uh, maximum number of allies. So I used to have, I guess, two or something. Now it says I have five. Now I should have six, I guess. Eh, I'm very confused. I don't know. Equip skills. I have zero stamina to use. I'm getting one stamina point per like five minutes, it looks. Let's go back. Summon heroes to be your allies. Mm. All right, so I can summon heroes for five orbs. Should we do that? I only have three orbs, so no. Let's go back home here. Get Torchlit Castle. Got some kind of achievement. Get Column Castle. Oh, it's my castle upgrades. Oh, see, we haven't even seen the castle yet. Getting all kinds of bonus items. This is my little castle here. Got some mail here. They're sending me some items for being awesome. We'll accept those items. And... How do I even close this shit now that I've done it? Received. Accept it all. Back arrow. Uh, this little thing on the wall. We're touching that little pad on the wall. Let's see what the hell that does. Do we want notifications? I don't know what the fuck that means. Just X that shit out. Um, home. So I am home. All right. Mm-hmm. Yes. yes. For, uh, battle. Story maps. Main story. World of Zenith. Proof of power. Let's do it. Looks like it takes an orb to uh, fight it. Or maybe I gain an orb. I don't know. Just that I had five. I thought I had three. Oh, because I, I did. I gained shit from my mailbox or whatever. Commander! Anna, brother! What has taken you so long to get to the world of mystery? Sorry, Sharina. We had to battle our way out of here. Who's with you? Oh, my. What a divine relic. It's all a glow. Are you the great hero? Ooh, Stardew Valley, Dark Might. I want to play. I want to play Stardew Valley now. Stardew Valley is pretty awesome, but you need uh, time. Like, you can't play for like five minutes. It's like you just need, you need like time, pay attention, and really like, you know, put 15 or 20 minutes in. So they're talking a bunch of crap. I'm going to skip it because I just don't care. I just want to fight you some shit. Some walls. Oh, I can destroy those walls, huh? Alright, so here's my team. They're on flying dragons and horses. Oh no, they are. I'm 
I don't have shit. Let's go. Hold on, let's see. What is a new symbol? It's, again, it's gray, not blue or green. Let's go. Let's destroy that wall. Yes. Destroy that wall. Very well. Very, very well. Onward. Yes. Onward. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing? Oh damn it! No, no, stay there. Indeed. Indeed. Now it's the enemy's turn. Now it's my Flyers turn. Fire to Oh, damn it. Fire an arrow at a flying unit to take it down more quickly. Oh, I should pay attention to that. Flyers are weak to arrows. That's what it said. So it's just three flyers there. So let's get one of these arrow dudes to make its way. Oh, it had to go. As you will. Hit the wall twice. My turn. Now I hit the wall twice. Now it's good. Mm, let's move her. She's hiding in the in the woods there. I love it. So a flyer versus an arrow. I'm guessing I'm at a disadvantage here. Holy shit. Maybe not. Attacking. No. Oh, what just happened? Oh, shit, everyone. Flyer dudes. Arrow. Get my arrow dude to come down here. Problem is I'm in the way. Yes. So let's move him out of the way so I can get an arrow dude closer to a flying dude. There's a little shield symbol. I'm curious yes. what that meant. Arrow versus flying, dude. And... This doesn't seem to go too, too well. Um, okay. I'm getting my butt whooped here. Oh, Dark Might. You might start your valley. So I said that like an hour ago. Oh, you don't see those notifications. Sorry, I must be talking to myself. I forget that this is set to only see, uh... This particular app doesn't see the other things on my screen. Super cool, actually. How that shall works. We? Yeah, we shall. You're a sword dude. You should fight another staff dude. Let me through. One down. Now we can get some arrow. Oh, level up. That particular dude, Alphonse, is level four. Let's arrow, go. arrow dude. Let's take out the flying dude. Ouch, is that good? Did I do good? Excuse me, my god, what a fucking pig. Whoever it is that burped. Oh, duh. I'm trying to compo control the computer guy because I'm stupid. Nice. Okay, level up for that person. Onward. I don't know if I should attack every time. I'm not really employing any strategy here. I'm just like, fucking attack! Enemy phase. I think I'm doing good. She's kind of cute. I like these characters. They're kind of cute looking. Oh, but you beat my cute girl. That makes me sad. What's... Oh, boy. I'm fine. Look. Dead. It. I won. Right? Oh, that's an enemy flyer dude over there. My turn. Let's get over there. I don't see any reason to like will. hide from the enemy. Because I've got like three or four people and it's just one. Dead. Level up. So everyone's leveled up, it looks like. She's level too. I like her. I like her little skirt. Little thigh highs. Stage clear. So, I mean, that's Fire Emblem. I haven't been paying attention. Maybe the story's interesting. I wish they presented it slightly differently than just the static pictures of people, but I get it. The artwork is very nice. I will give them that. Characters look, look good. Ah, itch on my nose. Blah, blah, blah. I got an orb. There's some quests, apparently. I got some progress in. Then I can go ahead and play Prologue Part 3. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to end this for now. But that's... um. 
quick peek at what uh, Fire Emblem Heroes looks like. When you first boot it up and play, be prepared for two downloads at the, at the current time. Uh, one of them is kind of lengthy, but it uh, wasn't terrible. Looks like a cool game. I'm not sure it's for me, but uh, I'll give it a little time and see. So far, it's super cool, and I was able to get started with uh, zero dollars. I mean, I grew up in a time where Revenge of Shinobi for the Sega Genesis cost me 60 bucks. So I'm the last person to complain about playing this game for free. And if I like it, if it needs a couple of bucks to uh, continue, I'm fine with that. I just don't want to play a game that's designed specifically to force me to require gems or jewels where the game isn't fun at all. It's all just about timers and gems and really not about gameplay at all. Um, but so far, Nintendo's games have not been that way at all. Super Mario World is 100% uh, playable uh, for three levels and then you pay 10 bucks and the whole game is yours. That's the way video gaming should be. Um, I'm totally down with that. So this one looks to be different. Looks like there's the orbs and whatnot, but as long as they're used to enhance a real game with real gameplay and not just a game that's constantly touch this, touch this, oh, wait five minutes, or buy some orbs. I'm not doing that stupid shit, you know what I'm saying? So that's all. There it is. It's interesting. Well made, looks like. Uh, I don't know if it's for me. I don't know if I'd play it again. Maybe uh, privately I'll tinker with it a little bit to see, but uh, I'm just not sure. So that's Fire Emblem Heroes, and it's available, I think, now on Android and uh, iOS for the whopping total of zero dollars and is put out by the number one gaming developer on the planet, Nintendo. Peace.